close your eyes and watch your breath. Take a couple of good long, deep in and out breaths so you know where the sensations of the breathing are in the body. And then just try to stay with those sensations. As for other things, you don't have to pay them any attention. Just stay right here. The mind needs a place to be still so it can see things clearly. If it's running around all the time, all it sees is a blur. So to see what's going on both outside and inside, you want to be still. To try to be still right here with the breath. Any thoughts that come through the mind, just let them go. You don't have to catch them, because if you try catching them, you go running off after them, and you're not going to get any stillness that way. So let the thoughts go. They can come and they can go. You don't have to get involved, and you don't have to check out to see if they're good thoughts or not. What the mind needs is this foundation. And so that's work that it's got to do. It means it has to put down all its other responsibilities for the time being. But you're not being irresponsible. In fact, once the mind has a good foundation like this, then it can take care of its daily responsibilities and a lot, with a lot more insight, with a lot more understanding. Also coming from a position of strength. So try to be strong right here. This is the real strength that allows you to withstand all the onslaughts of the world. Because the world comes at you from all directions. Sometimes it gives you gain, and sometimes there's loss of gain. Sometimes there's status, and sometimes it takes away the status. Sometimes it gives you praise, sometimes it gives you criticism, pleasure, and pain. And if you let yourself get lured out by the things you like, then you're, you've lost your foundation. And then when the things you don't like hit you, you don't know where to stand. So stand right here. Make this your default position. The place where you stay when the mind has all these other things happening. This is where you want to be. Don't let things pull you away. Otherwise the thought comes up and you jump right in. It's like somebody driving up in a car. and You jump right in, you don't even know who they are or where they're going. If you lived your life that way, you would die. Well, the mind has, has this problem too. Its goodness dies because you go jumping into thoughts that can lead you to all kinds of Unfortunate circumstances, unfortunate attitudes, unfortunate feelings, mind states. So try to stay right here and be solid right here. As for the world, it can go through, but it doesn't have to, you don't have to catch anything there. Because what does the world have to offer? All it has to offer is things it can take away. What you want to develop is the qualities that you develop in your own mind. That the world can't take away unless you give it away. So hold on to these good qualities. Because they're your source of strength, they're your source of insight. Being able to stay right here, you can see things clearly as they arise, as they pass away, as they come, as they go. And when you see them clearly and you have a much better attitude and much better awareness of what you can do about them, that's going to be skillful. So try to develop this foundation and maintain it as long as you can.